good evening a few more rafael fighter jets are going to land in india very soon and one probable question from this area is that india got rafael fighter jets from which country answer is from france we have already discussed this right just remember this now we'll also be discussing a few points regarding brahmos missile and uh, we'll also discuss few points uh, that are related to the 15th finance commission right and kindly remember 15th finance commission has already submitted its report but that report is for one year right and again the next report is going to be submitted that recommendations of the 15th finance commission are going to be implemented from 2021 to 2026 am i clear so this happens very rarely generally they submit the report for 5 uh, years because of certain developments that have been taken place last year they have divided the report and one report for one year and the second report for the next 5 years and that report is going to be the recommendations are going to be implemented from 2021 up to the year 2026 all these details will understand let me open the document now please have a look at this <clears throat> look at this which of the following country is affected by typhoon goni world's strongest storm so far you might have observed in various examinations that there are some definite questions from typhoons these typhoons are given different names and they attack with different intensities sometimes very horrifying and they create the disaster many people die and you know lots of property is lost and one such particular typhoon is which of the following country is affected by typhoon goni that is the world's strongest storm so far philippines canada france or mexico please remember and the answer is philippines please remember this this hit the eastern part of the philippines the typhoon is being considered as the world's strongest storm so far this year it has bring catastrophic violent winds and thus is being the hardest landfall on record please remember the name of the typhoon is important and which country is the worst affected with this particular typhoon answer is philippines next so this is the question here who is the chairman of the 15th finance commission you know all the names all are prominent people nk singh why we ready that is why venu gopal ready c is vijay kelkar or d raghuram rajan and the answer is option a that is n k singh please remember this look at this it was constituted on november 27th 2017 and the head is n k singh the 15th finance commission has finalized its report on fund devolution from the center to the states 3 years after it was constituted and the finance commission has finalized the norms for 5 years counting from 2021 to 2026 right so please remember this one next look at this recently which of the following released annual status of education report for rural india important one very 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 important one is it ministry of education kindly look at the option a earlier it was called ministry of human resource and development now it is called ministry of education option b niti aayog option c unesco option d pratham education foundation you must have heard about this answer is option d that is pratham education foundation look at this 
it was recently released by autonomous research and assessment unit and the name of the foundation is pratham education foundation right look at this another important one recently air launched version of brahmos missile was successfully test fired and the missile is a joint venture of india and very 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 important one we have discussed this one earlier many many times and the answer should be obviously option c that is russia clear you can read this the air launched version of brahmos missile was successfully test fired from su30 mki fighter aircraft the missiles are being produced by brahmos aerospace under the under an india russian joint venture these missiles can be launched from different platforms like land aircraft submarines and ships one of the wonderful cruise missiles we have that is brahmos right another important one which is always there in the news with respect to agriculture headquarters of nafed headquarters of nafed is located in important one answer is new delhi what is this in fact nafed stands for nafed is a nodal agency that implements the price stabilization measures right and that that uh, that is implemented under operation greens look at this other points nafed stands for national agricultural cooperative marketing federation of india this is an apex organization of marketing cooperatives for agricultural produce it was founded on october 2nd mahatma gandhi's birth anniversary in the year 1958 in order to promote the trade of the agricultural produce and forest resources in india and it was registered under multi state cooperative societies act it was one of the largest procurement and marketing agencies for agriculture products it has been headquartered in new delhi very 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 important one please remember this right so like this uh, daily we'll be learning the various topics like this and for today i'll stop at this teach and i'll see you in the next class with the more current affairs thank you so much